Hi, this is Edger Joe, and welcome to another video in the series on Excel tips and tricks. In the previous video, I showed you how to do VLOOKUP using a range, and then I had to fix it using absolute cell referencing, as you can see over there. So, what I'm going to do today is I'm just going to show you how to make a defined uh, to define a name or define a range, um, something like that. So, because in our VLOOKUP we refer to this range over here, I want to give it a name just to make it easier to work with so you don't have to go change things. So, what you do is you just highlight the range, then anywhere in that area you right click and you go and you say define name. I click on define name and I'm going to call this, um, let's call it movies right and then I say okay also see that by doing that it automatically puts absolute cell referencing in over there so I say okay and now that's done also you can see while that is highlighted you can see the word movies over there if I click away or if I do that if I just highlight extra cell there's nothing there but if I highlight that exact range you see the word movies right let's go back and do the VLOOKUP using the define name. So I go equal V lookup, open bracket, same as before, I click on the uh, lookup value, comma, then I type in movies, which is my um, range that I defined, comma, now it wants the column index, we know it's the second one it wants to return, I put another comma and we know we want an exact match, so that has to be false, close bracket, enter. So now when we copy this down, you won't get the error that you got before. So if I just delete maybe those ones as well and now I'm going to copy that down using the fill handle. Uh, we still get the, the NAs but um, just ignore that for a second. So we click on the drop down and we choose um, some of the values so you can just see how it works, how it changes all of those. Yeah. So that is how you can do it um, using a defined name like movie. So when we go down the list now, if you keep your eye there, I will move with my arrow, go down, but the movies, although the reference changes, the movie one stays the same. So that is how you can do it using a defined name. Thank you for watching.